Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel, BTM here. Now, if you have the iPhone 15 Pro Max and you heard about all of the different rumors out there about the quality of the phone, how it's easier to break than the 14 Pro Max, I got some for you. Let's check it out. So in today's video, I'm going to quickly go through the subcase Unicorn Beetle Pro case right off the rip inside the box you're going to get the case itself you're going to get a holster with a kickstand you're going to get an instruction manual with a QR code to send you to the site to show you how to install the phone inside the case more instruction manuals and then an installation guide as well all right so let's talk about the case these cases come in various colors now i chose the, the clear because i want to highlight the beauty of my phone now the case is made out of polycarbonate it has 360 degrees of protection the installation is pretty simple you just go down to the bottom of the phone, right hand corner, and you separate the outer screen protector from the bottom case itself. You take your phone and you simply place it inside the case. Make sure that it's aligned with the side buttons on both sides and of course on the bottom. And then you simply take your, take your case and I generally start from the top and work my way around. And this is probably the, the trickiest part here is to simply get that in the right position. And after you have gotten everything in there, go around and make sure that it's firmly in place. As far as the case itself, on the front, you're going to get full screen protection. It's very touch sensitive, which is also a plus. You're going to get covered buttons for your up and down rocker on this side. On the other side, you're also going to get a covered button. On the bottom, you're going to get two precise cutouts for your speaker grill and also a pull away tab that's completely protecting your USB type C port from dust, sand, and things of that nature. On the front, although you don't need it, you still have raised edges on the front along with the screen protector on the back you're going to get, again, raised edges around your camera. This is going to give you added protection. And what's nice about it also is you have side grips. You've got some ridges here that's going to increase your uh, grip ability. Also, on the back, you have your kickstand, which will give you the ability to view your media or videos or YouTube or movies in either the horizontal or the landscape mode, which is also quite nice. Now, it's rated for a 20 foot drop protection, which is more than enough. That's almost two stories if you think about it, which is really nice. It has reinforced corners that's going to give you added protection as well. Now it also comes with a belt holster. Now this is going to of course give you the ability to uh, holster this up to your belt. This belt clip is going to allow you to carry it around. Either you can carry it with your face in like this, fully protecting the phone, or if you don't want it that way and perhaps you're waiting on a phone call, you can place it like so. Not only does it serve as a holster and give you some added protection, it serves as a stand. That you could use it in the horizontal position for viewing movies. So, some of the cons. It does add a little bulk to your phone, 
which might be a non-starter for some. Also, it is not MagSafe compatible, which is a problem for some, but those are the only two cons that I could say. So if you're looking for a very high quality case, you want a case that's going to give you a kickstand, you want a case that's gonna give you 360 degrees of protection, you want your raised edges for your camera, you also want a holster, then this might be the case for you. A link will be in the description below, and I think it's going for about $26 on Amazon. Now, if this case doesn't fit your fancy, or if this case doesn't work for you, perhaps you might like this one up here.